Hello everyone, my name is Natasha. You can call me Miss Nat. I'm a lecturer at the Design Technology Program. If you are someone who's creative and if you like art and design of all kinds, then this program is a perfect fit for you. In this program, you'll be exposed to various challenges, mostly problems that you'll need to solve using your own design. So if you're a person who likes to solve problems, who likes puzzle, then this is a good program for you to try out. The duration of the program is three years. And we have three specialisations in this programme. There is graphic design, industrial design and also fashion and textiles. In all of it, you will meet a lot of experts in the industries who will guide you and give you feedback on how you can improve throughout your years of studies. And once you graduate from our programme, you'll be able to run your own business, be your own boss, be an entrepreneur. You can also be a, a graphic designer, a fashion designer or product designer. Basically, all the things that you can apply your skills of critical thinking and creative thinking skills too. So if you're interested to apply in our program, without further ado, I'll introduce you to three of my students. They're very talented and they'll guide you through on how to prepare your portfolio so that you can upload it to our eSaringan website. Hey Mira, have you submitted your portfolio? Yeah, I've submitted mine. Can you show me how? Sure. It's not really that hard. You just need to submit 10 of your best artworks in any media, traditionally or digitally. And remember, one drawing based on the team given. Do you still remember the format? I think I do. The format for the portfolio must be in PDF, in A4 size, and the maximum size of the file must be in 30 MB. Then, don't forget to put your IC and full name. One more thing is put the link, the embedded link, in your PDF. Uh, I think I should go and submit now. Yeah, you should. Yeah, I should go. Hi Mira. Hi Steph. Where is Moise going? Oh, he forgot to submit his portfolio. Oh, do you know what you should submit in your portfolio? First, we need to submit at least 10 of your best artworks, be it icons, hand-drawn sketches of your cats, building drawings. Would you like to add more, Mira? Yeah, or even simple things like this. Or another one is stickers design. In addition to that, you also need to complete and include one F4 size of artworks of any medium based on the tip given in the website. And remember to include your progress video link or any evidence of you completing your artwork inside your portfolio. And lastly, include your emails, your contact number inside the portfolio. That's all! What did you guys submit for your portfolio? What do we submit, guys? Uh, I submit my sketches, watercolor, pencil drawing, and even digital work. As long as you can draw, just submit it. How about you guys? I submitted my past works. I've done posters and some SMTs, advertising from my diploma years. So I included inside my portfolio. Uh, I think I have submitted a few comics that I've done um, and few tattoo design, stickers like this. Just make sure it is in the PDF uh, format and yeah, just draw anything. I plan my folio like best on like the aesthetic. There are trends mm -hmm. on like some design trends. So I include it in my, des uh, my portfolio design. Yeah, maybe you can try it out to make your portfolio interesting. My portfolio design is more formal. I make it very minimalist. I first put my sketches, then colouring. The last one will be digital and the last one will be like anything like fashion or 3D mod modelling, crafting. Yeah. I focus more on first impression. I put the best one as the first <coughs> one. Then variety of artworks. Like if I've done stickers, then I will show watercolors and then I will show maybe sculptures. Just show whatever you have done and be diverse in your in your portfolio. So what is your biggest tip for students who is thinking of applying but they are scared, scared or they are hesitant because they don't know how to draw? <laughs> it's important to show your interest. Yes. It's okay if, if it's not perfect, it's not your masterpiece, as long as you try and show that you are interested to join in this program. As long as you are interested, you are willing to learn. 
So guys, if you're interested in joining our very talented students here at the Design Technology Program at Unimas, make sure to check out our Unimas faculty website and we look forward to seeing you all soon. Also, side note, this video was directed, produced and edited by our own very talented students. So good job guys, I'm very proud of you all. Yeah, so we look forward to seeing you all soon. See you guys, bye! Yeah.